All right, welcome back, everybody. We're here tuned in with Jim Cummings. Today we have Erica Harlacker Stone. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. You know her from Persona, you know her from Seven Deadly Sins, and much, much more. Yes. yes. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. yeah. I couldn't believe your banner today. It was highly populated. <laughs> Thank you. I put a lot of characters on there just so people would walk by and go, hey, wait. <laughs> I gotta know. I don't know the name of that project, but I remember that character. That's so. right. Yeah. <laughs> it worked. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's very cool to be here with you. You know. Well, like, thank you for uh, taking time out and hanging course. out with us. I've been listening to you since I can remember. So. Well, it's because I'm very old. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's because you're very talented and you're in everything. I was just gonna say that. Yeah, yeah. But I was hoping you. I would. beat you to it. Yeah. Don't worry. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we're kind of neighbors. Almost. We're Kinda. both in Ventura County, California. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yeah. I uh, was born in Camarillo, yeah. and uh, it was a nice. Back then, it was like not a ton of people were there. I feel like yeah. it, it really filled out. All the orange groves are gone, mm. which is a bummer. <laughs> yeah, you're right about that. Yeah, because when they opened yeah. Soarin' Over California at California Adventure, it used to have Camarillo, and it was just the orange groves. And you yeah. could smell it. That yes. was like my favorite part. They, you can still yes. smell the oranges when you go on that ride, even though... They aren't there anymore yeah. on the ride or in real life. And it's not soaring over California anymore. No, I know. It's soaring around the world. Whatever. Yeah. We have mm. to give everyone else <laughs> a little bit of airtime, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Every time that guy hit the golf ball at the screen, I would always flinch. Oh, my God. Me, too. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> Memories. <laughs> so true. God, like, yeah. this is amazing. I mean, we've never worked together. But I feel like we have because you're at so many cons that I've I've been to and now we're yeah. here and so I feel now like we're we are working next together. To each other. Yeah. Thank you. Thank yeah, you for being thank here. Thank you. No, it's a it's a real honor. I, you know, I I've loved Winnie the Pooh since I was a kid and Aww. and you know Darkwing Duck, amazing. You're just Aww. I I love the passion and the everything that you put into the characters. It's a big inspiration. So. Well, thank you. Yeah. I've loved Winnie the Pooh since you were a kid, too. <laughs> so this is, us, we're going to get along fine yeah, here today. Yeah, great. <laughs> oh, well, that's very sweet. Thank you very much. Yeah. And thanks again for being here. Of yeah. course. Do you do a yeah. lot of these conventions? Um, yeah. Within the last few years, I started doing a lot more of them. I did some before the pandemic, mm -hmm. um, but they used to really stress me out because I would just kind of, you know, go I, by myself, I didn't really have a company helping me mm. navigate everything, and, uh, and I just, you know, I got into this because I like to act, so I, I don't really want to do all the businessy stuff, mm -hmm. and I'm also really bad at like being the bad guy if something goes wrong. So uh, yeah, and and things yeah. do, and things do, you know, yeah. as nice as everybody always is, you sometimes things happen, and uh, yeah, it's just. It's been so much nicer since I, I good. got with a company, and now I go to a ton of them. So. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. good. Well, yeah. Good, good, good. So, what's next? Where is next? Um, Who's next? I am gonna be in Salt Lake City in a couple weeks. I've heard oh, of this. So yes. will we. Oh, really? Okay, yes. great. I've heard of that Following place. <laughs> the mystical too. land of Utah. Yes, Salt Lake City. <laughs> Have you seen Book of Mormon? Of course. Yeah. I saw it twice. I saw it with the original Broadway cast. Oh, and no then I way. I saw the tour in LA. Yeah. No way. Isn't, uh, oh, shoot, the actor's name is. Oh, uh, Josh Gad? No, no, no. Oh. Uh, black guy. Oh. Who played the original um, uh, yes. General Buttfuck. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah he was there. <laughs> yeah. The whole original cast. He's going to be in Salt Lake, I'm pretty sure. So good. Oh, my God. I have to tell him he was so good. Yeah. <laughs> in the original cast. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was it was amazing. And it's like one of my favorite musicals. Yeah. I always say that's nice. the hardest I've ever laughed with any medium it's in that so span of time. Good, I, right? I just, every time it's in town. Really? Yeah. Saw it in London, saw it in New uh, York. I haven't seen it. I have uh, to go. You, you haven't? haven't? You have to see it. It's so good. Oh, wow. Oh, my yeah. gosh. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds about right. I yeah. will. I'll do it. Yeah. There's fireworks happening. It's very, very cool. exciting. Oh, perfect. Yeah. I was thinking. <laughs> I'm, it's I'm like we're... Are, should we be ducking? I know. I, I, I you know, was like, duck either and cover. we should hide <laughs> or it's a celebration yeah. for us, yeah. obviously. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Obviously for the podcast. Yeah. Is it time for... Is it, 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 what's that time? That's when I ordered them. Yeah. <laughs> perfect. So that, that perfect. Yeah. Glad you did. 
<laughs> very, very cool. Yeah. Well, speaking of theater, were you a were you a theater person in high yes. school? And yeah. yeah. Um, so I did a uh, speech and debate. I did improv. Me too. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, cool. What speech were your, and debate. What were your categories? Uh, well, I started off. Um, or I did. A, Something original oration. Oh, yeah. yeah. Boring. Uh, I did one. Uh huh. And then, uh, you know, I'm glad you asked that. I'm glad you, I made you ask me that. <laughs> <laughs> because um, then I, uh, I I switched over to humorous interpretation. Oh, yeah, humorous. And I just would do like, I, I did Guys and Dolls mm -hmm. and something called Green Pastures, oh, which okay. would be completely politically incorrect now <laughs> <No>. <laughs> because um, everybody in it was black. Mm hmm. And, oh. and, yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were in white face? <laughs> no, no, no. Well, well, in speech, you have to play all the characters Yeah, yourself. you have to play all the mm -hmm. characters. So I played, I did it <clears throat> just like this movie that was on a long, mm -hmm. old, ancient movie. Probably the 40s. And it was uh, a retelling of the Old Testament oh. uh, through an, an old black uh, church preacher oh. and everything. And so it, it, came, it was filtered through that. You know, and mm -hmm. the guy was probably from Georgia, somewhere like that. Yeah. And I did it all, and I made it all the way to uh, the, the state finals. Oh, nice. I was, yeah, I was, I was like, gonna be it, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. I thought, because I was so stupidly cocky, <laughs> uh, I, did, I did one speech for this, there were three rounds, one speech for this round, uh, guys and Dolls for the next round, and then Green Pastures for the third round. Oh, and wow. they compared them, and they go, well, wait, and, but but I got ones. Oh, wow. I mean, okay, it, it, good, was, yeah. it was like golf. It, th there were three judges. Yeah. And if they, they, they said, well, he was the best, so he's number one. Uh -huh. And it uh, sounds like I'm bragging. I'm really not. It was no, a yeah, stup I mean, it's kind of a stupid story. But uh, I, so I got a nine, which is the best you can get, uh -huh. because three good judges yeah. gave you one each. Yeah, that was great. And then they somebody discovered that I was sw switching around doing different speeches. I was going to say oh, that's so unusual. Well, we, 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 we can't we can't have that. <laughs> and I was thinking, well, no. doesn't it, doesn't that make it a little harder? Yeah, you I, I mean, I would I feel they should be more got impressed. Ones. <laughs> Yeah, it is more impressive. But when you said that, I was like, whoa, you can do that? <laughs> you can do a different <laughs> thing for each round? Yeah. Appar yeah. Apparently not. Yeah. You, you can, but they'll... You can, but you can't win. Hand your... Smack your little hands. Yeah, you can do it just, just because you want to. Just because... Uh, or yeah. can. Yeah. <laughs> kind of yeah. like white dogs. Anyway. Yeah. Man, because that's they so can. cool. Yeah, I, so. I feel like uh, most people... When I say speech and debate, they're like, "What is that?" <laughs> really yeah. exciting, yeah. Yeah, I did. Wow. Uh, I did HI humorous, and I did uh, dramatic DI, and mm -hmm. then um, I loved duo too because I got to work with a partner. Oh, that's so, cool. Yeah. Plus, you have to memorize less. Yes, exactly. That's... There was one. There was one category which was only in our county, as far as I know, and it was called thematic, and. Mm. The reason that I liked it was because it was the only category that you were allowed to have a binder up there with you, so you could have the lines <laughs> so, written down. Yes. You couldn't read it the whole time, but you were allowed to glance at it every now and then. Okay, so you, anytime <laughs> you're allowed to take a test with a cheat sheet. Exactly. Yeah, no, that's why I went into voiceover. I don't have to memorize anything. It's great. Yes, <laughs> oh my God. Boy, you are singing my, th right? how many times have I said that? Yeah, yeah. When I was a theater major in college, I was like, man, if I just didn't have to memorize all this stuff, oh. <laughs> it would be so nice. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm known for terribly uh, ad-libbing like, mm -hmm. oh, yeah. all the time, uh -huh. you know, in, in every single thing I do. And, um, and the only reason that I'm good at it is because I can't memorize anything. Yeah. It's like for the worst reason in the world, but, <laughs> but it accidentally kind of, trained that little muscle inside of me to well what was i supposed to say make something up okay and then then yeah, they're, they're off, off to the races yeah that's why i love improv so much because mm. I, I just feel like you just you just go with your instincts and it was so fun i was in the second city conservatory oh, before, wow, cool. before the pandemic hit and then you know everything kind of stopped so i haven't mm. been back since but i miss it oh yeah <laughs> at some point and where where were you based in, in, in like Hollywood? Was that uh, yeah, the Second yeah. City? Yeah, yeah. Second City Hollywood. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Yeah. And it was it was so fun. That's pretty darn cool. I was well, real well, close to the end, but oh well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Are, are you leaning back into it now, or what's yeah, happening? Yeah, well, they did. They shifted to online, 
Mm. And doing improv over Zoom is the worst thing. Thank you. I have ever experienced. Yes. Especially doing because improv over Zoom. Yeah. So like, you know, how Zoom it'll like it'll focus on the person talking. So then it will kind of cut off anyone mm -hmm. else who wasn't just speaking and there's like lag issues and when we first shifted over to zoom i was like okay well should all of our scenes be like we're talking we're on like a webcast mm -hmm. or something and they were like no pretend you're in the same room and i was like this Ooh. is so hard yeah <laughs> so you know, yeah yeah my daughter raleigh uh, was doing it a play she, she's an actress and mm -hmm. as soon as they were ready to open they said oh you can't what <laughs> No, 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 you have to have to be remote. Oh, you have no. to be sitting at home in your bedroom, your de you know, uh, with the with the camera on you. And then and and it was like the, the beginning of the Brady Bunch mm -hmm. yeah. with, the, with, with the all the Brady's <laughs> on the screen and they're all sitting yes. there. And, it, you know, it'd be somebody would. And it was just awful because somebody would have to be handing somebody a, a, a drink and they go, well, here, George. And, you know, and and somebody would be just like their friend would be over here. And they'd hand the, the drink here. I almost poured that on myself. I can't believe you didn't spill that. That was I incredible. That was like impressive. a magic trick. I, 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 I just realized you took the goddamn cap off. <laughs> but anyway, and, and then, you know, they'd hand it over here and it would come in down there. Uh -huh. And it just, it was so realistic. Yeah. It was awful. <laughs> but uh, she was great. The, Raleigh, you know you were great. Impressive blocking. I mean. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, yeah, yeah so I, I did like one, one semester on Zoom and man, the fireworks are yeah, going crazy. Are going By the way, we're oh, under. they're so pretty. Oh my gosh. Oh, you can see them. Yeah. yeah. I don't know where we are that there's fireworks happening right now, but. Yeah, for everybody listening, oh. we're clearly, <laughs> yeah. we're in Little We're not Rock. under attack, I swear. It's yeah, a very pretty fireworks show. I was thinking we are under attack, but yet <laughs> we're forging ahead. Yes. <laughs> so I hope you understand the gland. Yes. That we are uh, yes, expressing yes. here. This is for this you guys, for just, all of you. Just for y'all. Mm -hmm. The podcast must go on. So. Yeah. Yes. It oh must. my God. Have you seen Peter Pan Goes Wrong? I have not. Oh my uh -oh. God. No. It's so good. I'm sorry. I go that to a sounds, lot of theater. <laughs> that sounds nice. It's so good. I think it's playing. It might have. It might have just ended this weekend. But mm. if it's not, you should really go see it. It's in LA right now. Yeah. And I think Peter Pan Goes Wrong. Yeah. You can't beat that title. Oh my God, it's so funny. It's, have you seen the play that goes wrong at all? I, I was in it. actually have, oh. yeah. Were you? No, I okay. mean. Not, <laughs> oh, I see, I mean, you were just a, in a, a play lot that of goes plays wrong. that yes, kind of yeah. went wrong. Yeah, well that's the basis of the play yes. that goes wrong is that it's, they're putting on a regular play, but then mm -hmm. set pieces start falling oh, and you know, the yeah. blocking's incredible because they have to have everything go wrong mm. in a very specific way. Oh, right, right. And so Peter Pan Goes Wrong is the same company. It's just oh, a new show. And okay. It was even better. It was so funny. Oh, Highly nice. recommend it. Where'd you oh, see that? Cool. Um, it was at the Amundsen, I think, in okay. LA. It's touring yeah. right now. So if people look at their, their tour, tour dates. <laughs> yeah. But it's so good. Yeah, assuming we're, I think we're allowed to go back to the theaters now. Yeah, yeah. You know, you're, it's yeah. definitely allowed. I've been, I saw Into the Woods recently and I saw oh. Peter Pan Goes Wrong. Yeah. Yeah, everything went wrong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Everything went right and you made it. Yes, yes. Oh, very I had cool. To, you know, I couldn't go to theater for so many years because of the pandemic, so I'm yeah. trying to see as much as I can again. Yeah. I also saw Beetlejuice recently. Oh my God, so good. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I literally had tickets for the Book of Mormon like <gasps> two no. months before the pandemic no. hit. It was in LA and I was like, everybody, we should all go as a family. Yeah. Oh, man. And then the pandemic really threw things off. I know. Oh my gosh. Yeah. But now? We can see, we can watch it again. Back in action. I'm so excited, so excited. It just has to come back to LA. Yes, I know. Yeah. I mean, I, I think it's going to at some point. I'm sure point. it will. Yeah, yeah. it only really tours all the well, time. Well, we'll be there when it gets there. Good, good, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> more or less. But yeah, Peter Pan goes wrong. Super good. Yeah, cool. so yeah. I heard that you can't even go to Japan because you'll just be so swarmed. Is that true? Can you tell us about that? I uh, am not swarmed in Japan. No. I am really tall, so I feel like people are like, whoa. Um, <laughs> and I did, I went to Japan for three weeks for my honeymoon last year. Oh yeah, congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. 
And uh, while we were there, you know, uh, people would ask like, oh, what do you do? And so I would say I was a voice actor. And then you said, whatever I want. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Well, and over there, like being a voice actor is like the coolest job Mm. you could have, you Mm. know? And so. Oh, we're going to Japan. Yeah. 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 As soon as I said voice actor, everyone was like, oh my gosh. Oh, wow. That's so cool. Like, what were you in? And I was like, well, I mean, I'm in the English version of. Yeah. Yeah. But they didn't, they didn't care. They were like, oh. You're in Hunter Hunter. Oh my gosh! You're in Seven Deadly Sins, Demon Slayer. How cool! And it was really cool. It was. That's it was, neat. It was nice. Yeah, it was. It was. It's super good to be cool. a rock star, right? Every now yeah, and then. Yeah. Yeah. And I like, you know, I like, I like people not really knowing who I am until I, I say something about it, because then, because I don't, I don't want to be. Mm, yeah. I don't want people to come talk to me all the time. <laughs> so. <laughs> yeah. It was nice. Yeah. Yeah. No, I I agree. It's yeah. like. Uh, it's a weird thing because, uh, you know, you don't you don't want to feel like you're obligated to be on. Exactly. At all. Yes. And, you know, yeah. You know, can we, can, hey, can, can we just call my eight nieces and nephews? <laughs> yeah. You know, I don't know. Maybe not right now. Yeah. You know. Yeah. I've had instances where I like go to the grocery store and then there's a Persona fan at the checkout. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, I'm so happy to meet them. But also I'm like, oh my God, I was not prepared to meet a fan right now. Right, I need to right. start dressing better when I go to the grocery store. Oh God, yeah, <laughs> and, uh, I thought yeah. the same thing. Yeah, so I get a little, little anxious now that people yeah. have started. I think because <laughs> I started doing YouTube stuff more so people mm. know what I look like more now. Mm. So mm-hmm. it happens a little more often. What do you do on YouTube? Um, I play a lot of the games that I'm in. Oh, no way. Uh, yeah. And I mean, mostly I do that. I also play, I do a monthly Among Us game with the cast of a game that I'm in. Cool. And so, you know, whoever's available. Are you on games. Twitch? Mm. I was on Twitch, but I like YouTube better because <laughs> I would always forget to download my streams from Twitch and then they disappear mm. after oh. a couple months. And so there are some streams that I did of Persona in particular that are just lost forever. Uh, that ain't whoops. right. I know. On YouTube, it keeps them forever. So. I'm sure somebody yeah. recorded it somewhere. Yeah, somebody's you, got it. Yeah, I got, like, clips of it. But, yeah, huh. I mean, probably if I asked, I could have okay, somebody well, give it to me. Okay, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> you, you've me. got your work cut out for you, yes. right? My whole 100 hours of Persona that I played, please. <laughs> <laughs> How hard could that be? Yeah, That's somebody not too has much it, right? to ask. <laughs> Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. Give me it. <laughs> Jeez. No. Give us a break already. <laughs> yeah, nice. I, I like it. It's it's fun. I put up some of my, uh, I did a couple music videos that I put on YouTube. And, oh, right on. Uh, do you make music? I do, yeah. Oh. Um, I have two singles out so far. Um, and then I also did a cover uh, that got really popular in the, <laughs> in the Genshin Impact fandom. Because nice. it was it was really cool. The company that does the game, I asked them. I was like, "Hey, I really think this song fits my character really well. Yeah. Can I do an in-character version?" And usually they'd be like, you know, every company would be like, "No," but they're super cool about it. And they were like, "Yeah, sure, that sounds oh, great." Oh, that's great. Yeah. So I made a music video and wow. Yeah, it's it's really well, cool. So where can everybody <laughs> see it and love it? So it's on. Well, you can listen to it on Spotify. Um, okay. I have three songs up there, and then you can wow. watch the music video on YouTube. My channel is with a K Games, because everyone spells my name E R I C A. So mm. <laughs> my brand oh. is now with a K everything. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I see yeah. where you're going with this. Yeah, yeah. Which That's cool. I always laugh extra hard in the comments when people will write Erica with a C, and I'm like, hello. <laughs> oh. It's in the name, you guys. Yeah, it's built right in. Yeah. But Read. No. Alas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's oh fun. God. And I, right uh, I just finished writing a novel. I have like too many things going on. Uh, oh wow. All at once. I have a, Jesus. My focus is unfocused. So. And and then <laughs> you're, you're gonna open the show tomorrow with some juggling. Yes. I understand. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Um, good. Unicycle <laughs> also at the same time, um, while I'm playing the accordion. So. Mm-hmm. So, we got that going for us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll be looking forward to that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that no, is it's, dos mucho. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah. I just like being creative. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Jim you do. has a musical background as well. Yeah, 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 he do. Yeah. So cool. I was always, uh, I was always the, the the singing drummer. Nice. Yeah, and then finally, uh, I auditioned for this band that already had a drummer, and I go, "Can I sing?" <laughs> and so then they let me sing. 
Oh, that's and so cool. And then all I had to carry was a tambourine and a cowbell. Oh, hey, those are fun. You know, I love it. <laughs> as much as I love the drums, tambourine, cowbell, much lighter. Yeah, those are yeah. those are very Less easy. Less work. You can you just know. loop them onto your belt. I accidentally took mine off before, <laughs> you know, because I was going to impress you with my... Oh, darn it. Next time. Try to luck. Next time. I, both at once. Cowbell and yeah, tambourine. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Plus singing. Yeah. Well, there you go. And, and tap dancing, which is hard in Ooh. OCs or yes. whatever these are. That's Tennis shoes. extra impressive then. You yeah. Know? Oh. <laughs> well, don't be too impressed yet. <laughs> so did you do musical um, theater? Uh, yeah, I oh, did, nice. I guess. Cool. I was the, I lived right next door to my high school oh. in, in Youngstown, <laughs> Ohio, Convenient. and I was always in, in plays as a little kid, mm -hmm. and whenever they would need, like, I was the, I was the, the little kid in The King and I, oh. and a, a few other shows like uh -huh. that, there was, what else was there, Guys and Dolls, um, cool. but I, the, I was always literally in the neighborhood, so they were, <laughs> well, get that little shit over there, that, <laughs> that, that little weasel, you know. Oh, yeah. And because uh, my, my older brothers and my older brother and sisters went there, so they kind of mm -hmm. knew me. Oh, know. nice. So I got drafted into being a uh, musical theater. They yeah. were giving you yeah. the skills for your future yes. career. So we should thank <laughs> all of them. I, for oh, doing I that. do. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, and I, it was, it was great, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was so cool. really, really a, a, a great way. And, and then that started me singing. Yeah. Awesome. You know, so. And you also did an abridged version of the Phantom of the Opera, correct? Oh, with, oh uh, yes, I did with, with Tara Strong. With Tara Strong. Oh my gosh, and yeah. great love, Tara Strong. That's so cool. I love abridged versions of things. They're always so funny. Yes, <laughs> yes. And, uh, he was bound to love you. Oh my gosh. When he heard you sing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Anyway, that was, I think I accidentally sang her part. <laughs> I think that was the first time you sung on the podcast. I think Yay! so too. And it sounded great. <laughs> Can we get some more? Well. <laughs> I the phantom of the opera is due inside your mind. Ooh, oh, I'm, okay, wait, we're done. <laughs> I am geeking out. The Phantom of the Opera is my favorite so play. Cool. I yeah, love yeah. a tattoo yeah. of the Phantom of the Opera. Nice. Yeah, how about oh that? Yeah, my too. Classic. Yeah. Wow, yeah. that was seen, so cool. Oh, and it was the best music in the world. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I saw it on Broadway when I was in high school, and mm -hmm. man, it was so cool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was so cool. Yeah, I saw it on, uh, where did I, we saw it in London. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I saw it in London. And nice. uh, and Broadway, mm -hmm. and uh, at the Pantages, I think, in LA. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, who was your favorite Phantom? You know, I don't know. I can't, yep. I couldn't name a Phantom. Oh, okay. To be quite well, honest with you. Wasn't him. Gerard Butler? No. Yes. <laughs> he was. Yeah, really? He was. In the movie. In the movie, yeah. Okay, yeah. the movie. Okay, yeah. in the movie. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I, I don't think he's my favorite Phantom. I wouldn't say that either. No. But no. Robert Guillaume was amazing. And I'll tell you, uh, what, who was it? Michael Crawford was the first one I saw. And he was the acting mm. you know the, the big big broadway guy uh -huh. and and i came up came away because i saw it like three three or four times and uh after his performance which i ended up seeing twice i ended i i was walking away going that is the most amazing performance of an actor a, mm -hmm. an incredible singer an incredible actor incredible oh my god choreography this this that and the other thing and i thought that was it and then there was another guy norman somebody and he was another study pretty doggone exceptionally good mm -hmm. and then when i saw robert guillaume uh -huh. my reaction was oh my god <laughs> poor bastard <laughs> <laughs> that phantom because i mean he really was a tragic figure oh. but 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 with michael crawford you didn't he didn't feel the tragedy you just yeah. felt the right 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 aren't mm -hmm. i great and with robert yeah. guillaume you're going you know what if you think about it this guy's screwed yeah his face is jacked up Yes. Everything is about him, and and he was so vulnerable, mm -hmm. and so, you know, and 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 he he made you feel. Yeah. He made you feel it. This so. is why I love seeing plays more than once with different casts, because mm -hmm. yeah. I feel like everyone, if they're doing it right, brings something new to the character, and it's just yeah. so cool. Even if you know, I'm like, I didn't like them as much as the other person. It's still, I don't know. It's such a such a cool cool experience. Yeah. I know exactly oh what yeah. You mean. Yeah. 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 Yeah, God. Uh, I've always amazing. said they should do that with movies. Like they remake movies, yeah. but use the exact same script and then let's yes. see how it'll go differently with that direction cool. and mm -hmm. acting. I mean, that's what plays are, you know? That's they don't true. change oh, yeah. the script. No, yeah. You know, yeah. why don't why don't we do that with cinema? It's that's like a good question. 
Especially yeah. if it's already such a good script. Yeah. Maybe you don't need to rewrite the whole thing. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just yeah. have a new cast. Yeah. yeah. My favorite movie is The Matrix and the Wachowski sisters shot so much footage for that movie that they literally could just re-edit and have a completely different movie. Do it. Off the first really? one. I do know. It. I thought I kind of thought that's what they were gonna do with that Matrix four. <clears throat> <laughs> I don't recognize that movie, but... There's a fourth one? Yeah, Crazy. there is not. I'm, Whoa. There's not. <laughs> That's a glitch in our Matrix. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. well, we, we cleared that up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Sorry, man. I could talk about theater forever, but uh, I too. won't. That's not oh, why we're that's here. That's cool. That's cool. That's sure it is. <laughs> we're here to have that's a discussion. That's true. I guess that is how I ended up here, but... That's right. That's, yeah. that's, the, that's how you got here. Yeah. In my, yeah, in my high too. school... From seventh to twelfth grade, every spring semester was just Shakespeare for our English Ooh. courses. So well, that wasn't very ambitious at all then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, so I, you went the easy way. Exactly. Yeah. So I, I started off with the easy stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then yeah, wound up in an anime. You know, I don't know. I don't know what happened there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So and at the end of the at the end of the year, each grade would do an abridged version of each of the whichever play mm. the grade was working on. Um, and so I've, I've always just, mm -hmm. I, lo I love abridged versions of things and I just, I, I think that was so cool. I feel like more high schools should do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's pretty cool. I feel like if you can read and understand Shakespeare, you're pretty good on mm -hmm. most other things. Yeah, yeah so, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. You suffer them slings and arrows, damn it. <laughs> yeah. Mm. <laughs> right? Oh my gosh. Oh, it's been a while. I need to go see another Shakespeare play at some point. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, I think we're, we're allowed to go back outside now. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Gonna, so. I'm, I'm seeing all, I'm seeing everything. <laughs> everything I come across, every every play. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. we were just yeah. talking about stand-up comedy at yeah. a, a dinner, are you a yeah. comic fan? Uh-huh, I, I saw, um, what did I see? I saw John Mulaney recently. Oh yeah. Mm. Um, his like comeback tour. Mm -hmm. And oh, I, had, yeah? I had been, I had seen him before before everything went down. And then I was like, what, is this gonna be like a whole new feel? What's going on here? Oh, okay. And it was, he was still very funny. Oh, yeah. good, good, good. Um, so, you know, I still still had a good time. Yeah, and, very cool. Uh, yeah, I don't go to a lot of live stand-up comedy, but mm. I like watching them on YouTube. Well, you go all the time. I gotta start yeah, joining I you. I try and go once a week. Who do you, yeah. who do you like? The last person I saw was Jeremy Piven mm. and uh, Trevor Wallace from social media. Oh, you know, yeah. Trevor Wallace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And mm -hmm. they were hilarious. Yeah. Oh, man. They were so I would so never funny. have thought Jeremy Piven was. Yeah. Because I know him best from uh, Entourage. Entourage, yeah. 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 He was killing it. And wow. Yeah. And I didn't even know. I had to Google him after. And he's almost 60 and he looks great. Whoa. He looks oh, great. Really? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, he must dye his beard. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I think so. I do too, but I dye it gray. Yes, <laughs> or is yes. it white? For the I think distinguished it's look. Full blown, full blown white now. <laughs> Silver fox. Yeah, there you go. I really want to see uh, Jeff Dunham at some yeah. point. And then yeah. there's another yeah. like Australian puppet stand-up guy mm -hmm. who I forget his name. Yeah. But he's also really good. Mm. <laughs> I can't think of him. I yeah. Can't either. We're uh, we're gonna have uh, Bert Kreischer. You know Bert Kreischer. No. He always performs shirtless, <laughs> no, has that big know. belly. Yes. I don't know that I've ever seen him. He just had a new movie come out. Oh, uh, yeah. What was the name of that? Um, the Machine. Yes. Oh, the Machine. Cool, cool. Yeah, he's going to join us insane. in the podcast here. Oh, in a nice. Weeks. Yeah. It was ridiculous. Yeah, check it out. Awesome. Yeah I'll, yeah, I'll look into it. Check it out. Yeah, we promised him we'd promote it because he's struggling. Perfect. Yes, that's what <laughs> so, we're doing. So we're here. I feel we're like. We're here. We give till it chafes. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like my TikTok al algorithm. It has just fluctuated between stand-up comedy and just animals looking cute. <laughs> so it's, it depends on the week, and mm -hmm. that's what I see. Yeah. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you know, baby kittens hanging on to yes. ropes. Oh, my God. With yes. kittens with yarn. Ah. So, that's my favorite TikTok page. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> kittens with I, yarn. <laughs> I've been getting a lot of Zay Frank videos. Mm. Do you know Zay Frank? Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. Mm -hmm. With his... Crazy Dave, this is Crazy Dave here. Yeah. So I love those videos. Every time they come up, I start smiling and my husband goes, is that the animal guy? And I go, yes, <laughs> he's talking about giraffes, but he calls them gruffuffers. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> oh, so simple, love it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so we do, this, we do this fun little thing on the podcast. Who would you say is your most popular character? I think... Maybe right now it's Venti in Genshin Impact. Okay. 
um, which came out in 2020, which mm -hmm. I think is why it got so popular because yeah. it was. You yeah, know. everybody's stuck at home. Exactly. So Might everyone well. was like, what's this new game? Might as well bust it out. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So a lot of like teenagers love Genshin Impact. And oh, yeah. I, I well, play it cool. on. Yeah, I play it on my YouTube. It's very fun. It's like actually a very mm. fun game. Um, it's also free to play. So it's very accessible. Mm -hmm. So no, I think that's bad. also why it's. Yeah, you can like, you know, pay money if you want extra stuff in the game. That's how they make the most money these days. Exactly. Huh? Yeah, I try to on my YouTube play it without putting any money in to show people like you can play the whole game without mm. paying money, which is really cool. Um, mm. So yeah, I'd say he's like a drunken bard character. Yeah. Oh, he's, cool. He's very fun. He's just venti the bard. <laughs> What's up, traveler? He's just, <laughs> oh, you know, nice. Yeah, the yeah, god yeah. of freedom, you know. Yeah, he's, we were just cool. with uh, Sarah Miller Cruz yes! last weekend. Oh my gosh, yeah. yeah. I love Sarah. Uh, she is on one of the uh, series on my YouTube. Mm. I'm introducing okay. Kingdom Hearts to her. Oh, she yeah. had no idea what it was. Well, there you go, mm. Kingdom Hearts. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Jim, I'm familiar Jim's with also that. In it. Yes. Yeah. She did not know who Pete was. And what the? I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I sometimes I'm like, are you an alien? How do you not know anything? Now come on. <laughs> <laughs> now come on, dear girl. What's the matter with your face? Yes. And so we <laughs> That's just insane. We, yeah, right. And so we just started Kingdom Hearts too. And she was like, who is this? And I was like, oh, what? This is Pete. What do you? <laughs> it's Pete. Now she's she'll text me if she sees like any videos, and she's like, Pete, I know Good. who that is. That's right. <laughs> well, you know, people think uh, Mickey Mouse is the the oldest Disney character because he is. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, I think Oswald Rabbit predates it. Yes. But mm -hmm. um, Pete and Mickey Mouse were both in Steamboat Willie. Yes, we just did that level in Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. So, oh, Ooh. see. Uh huh. Yeah. Wow, oh, this is it like, all in. And Ooh. again, she was so she was Are like, you "What is this?" Goosebumps. Yeah. Like, I, I mean, <laughs> I'm going crazy over here. But, she was yeah. like, she. So we, you know, we went up to Pete, and he was like, "Oh, somebody stole my the little guy stole my boat," and she was like, "Who could that be?" And I was like, "Have you? Do you not know Steamboat Willie? Like, do you not?" know any of this? <laughs> yeah. And I was like, you know, Mickey, he was kind of like a troublemaker. He was always, he was taking Pete's stuff. They kind of switched places. And, uh, That's right. Yeah. And she, I'm teaching her so much. I'll, gi I'll give you a hint. <laughs> wow, pal. Yeah, that's that's all I that's all I've got. Beautiful, love it. That's all I've got. You yeah. just do the whole yeah. all of the characters. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, uh, you know, speaking of that, well, since you insist on me telling you. <laughs> Uh, I'm Baloo now. I, 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 I <gasps> kind of uh, ended up being Baloo by That's default. Funny. I was talking with my buddy Rick Dempsey, he's head of Disney Character Voices. And it was a couple weeks ago, about, about a month ago, talking about this and that. And, and, and I said, what are you doing? And I said, what, what are you up to? What are you? And he says, well, I'm currently casting for Baloo. Ooh. And I said, Baloo? And, and I'm King Louie for, uh -huh, for right. Disney too. Mm -hmm. And I said, well, come on there, little britches. We can do something for you. Let me know what I can help you out with. <laughs> and he goes, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <sighs> Thank you. I, I, you just cleared my afternoon. <laughs> and, I, and he goes, okay, yeah, no, you're, you're blue. You're blue. And I had two lines. <laughs> wow. Anyway, I'm blue. Oh, yay. That's so how you get you roles in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. you By just, accident. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Talking on the phone up. with the mm -hmm. casting director and yeah. being a goober. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just just sit down with the head of character voices. Yeah, yeah that's all you have to do. <laughs> that's all you sure. have to do. Here, let, you know what? I've got my I've got his number. <laughs> <laughs> let me get it. You guys are really yeah. all slacking out there, all you guys who want to be yeah. voice actors. Come on. Yeah, stop asking. Yeah. Just yeah. go do it. Seriously. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, people say, well, very you cool. know, one of my favorite things is when they'll say, in, in fact, uh, oh God, of all people, uh, they did it to Paul McCartney on uh, on Saturday Night Live. Uh -huh. They'll say, "Well, so uh, are you doing? So you're Winnie the Pooh? Yeah, Tigger? Yeah. What's that like? <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh -huh, yeah. <laughs> what are you supposed to say? I know, I know. People every every time I do a panel, they're yeah. Like, What's it like being a voice? Like, do that you like? like being a voice actor? What's, What's that, that like? like? Yeah. And I'm like, it's cool. I, yeah. it's cool. I, I wanted to do it, so, so you're I at do a it. Panel now? Yeah, yeah. yeah. What, what's it like being here? It's great. It's cool. It's fun. Oh, yeah. 
She's, she's <laughs> kind of a panel now. Yeah. That's, <laughs> just a little How are we bit doing so there. far? It's pretty good. You What's know, it like? I like it. It's okay. Like, oh, okay. Good. This is this is better than the okay. panels where they just pl- close, plot me right, on Jane? stage and they're like, go. And I'm like, oh my god, hello. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys want to talk about? I have no plan at all. Uh, yeah, yeah. So. <laughs> that's good. That's a good plan. Uh-huh. Yeah. I've had that yeah. same plan my yeah. whole life. And just you know, improv, baby. Yeah. <laughs> we'll yeah, feel yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. I remember seeing Raiders, the first Raiders, of the Lost Ark, and mm-hmm, somebody yeah. said to Harrison Ford, "We go. Well, what are we gonna do next?" He goes. I don't know. I'm making this stuff up as I go along. Yes. <laughs> I'm saying, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's how I feel every that day. Was, that hit a bullseye. <laughs> yeah. Me. I often am like, I have no clue what I'm doing. I somehow <laughs> managed to trick people into thinking I know what I'm doing. But really, I'm just kind of like showing up and uh, doing my best. <laughs> Fooled me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> thank <laughs> you. Thank you. <laughs> I'll join a very large club. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Keep yeah. those hits coming. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, did we talk about what's next for you? Where, where, yeah, where wait, you going? Before we do oh, that, man. I wanted to. Oh, uh, uh-oh. I kind of got There's off track. More. We like oh, to yeah, do sorry. this thing we, on, uh, the, on the podcast. It's crazy. And uh, I, that's why the reason why I asked you what your most popular character is. We like to do, you know, a little role reversal. Oh, so, Jim okay. will feed you a line as one of his characters, and okay. you do it in your character voice, okay. and then okay. vice cool. versa. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we'll start with you, Jim. Give her a line of okay. one of your. Would you please pass the honey for me? Would you please pass the honey for me? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you did Satan. I know. He kind of, well, he's, he's a mischievous god, so you're not far off. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, very cool. <laughs> and then I give you a venti line. Yes, you okay. do. Um, wouldn't gliding be faster? Wouldn't gliding be faster than bouncing? <laughs> it would, it would, yes. Thank yeah. you for acknowledging <laughs> Probably. that. Probably. <laughs> yes. Yay! Oh, that's cool. Man. Very Jeez. exciting. Okay, so, so one more or what? Yeah, let's do Again? one more. Again? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I am the terror that flaps in the night, and you're not. I am the terror that flaps in the night, and you're not. <laughs> wow. you sounded just like you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Um, let's see. Okay, you, there's context for this line. Okay. His true name is Barbados. Oh, I've heard of him. But he, yeah, yeah. So he's the god Barbados. So, and then when he opens a treasure chest in the game, he goes, "Think Barbados." Wait a minute. So. <laughs> think Barbados. Wait a minute. Think bonkers. <laughs> oh, yeah, bonkers. Oh, yeah. Man. Yeah, I, I sang that, that theme song to my husband once, and he was like, how do you remember every word of wow. this theme song? And I was like, I don't know. Bonkers. It's just totally nuts. Yeah. Bonkers. No whips, ands, or buts. Wow. <laughs> Jeez. It's, you it's know, it's catchy. weird because it, Bonkers is, not that we're talking about that, but he's gotten a recent resurgence, and I guess it's from uh, Disney Plus. Yeah. Oh, that's, yeah. oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. I need to rewatch it. It's on Disney Plus. I didn't even I think th- about well, it. Well, see. I think you all should. Yeah, yeah. it's and a really, it's a good show. <laughs> if you want to watch yeah. it with commentary, we just did a deep dive episode of Bonkers. Oh man, on okay, well, in with Jim Cummings. Perfect. Gonna, that's how I'm going to watch it then. <laughs> just total coincidence. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Could have happened to anybody. Mm-hmm. Like we just walked into that naturally, so you yeah. Know, so see, natural promotion. Didn't Don't plan it. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh well, good stuff this was thank so you fun enough. yeah no, thank you thank so you. much like this is i mean you know back when i was just a, a little speech speech and debater mm-hmm. i just did acting for fun and then i uh, you know I, I always liked cartoons and video yeah. games i never i never grew out of it and uh why then, why bother right exactly it's it's more fun to just embrace those kinds of things yeah and, mm-hmm. So it's so cool to be yeah. sitting here with you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Ladies and Yay. gentlemen, my goodness. Thank you. Thank, Thank you very you. much. <laughs> we really appreciate you doing this. Yeah, totally. Uh, no, yeah. It's, it, it's, it's really fun. You know, I, I love it. Yeah, and thank you for staying up with us. For of course. Yeah. Everybody, yeah. everybody listening, it's what? Shoot. It's 3 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> yeah, it's quarter after 10. Yeah. Okay, but after like, a long day. Close. After a long day, too. That's true. We did have it a, long was day. a long day. But yeah. West Coast time, it's only like a quarter after 8. Yeah. So. Yeah. 
Okay, fine. You ruined the illusion. <laughs> fine. It's I was not trying that to I was trying bad. to get sympathy points. All right, anyway. right, right. Oh yeah. It's actually five in the morning. We've stayed up all night. In That's Australia, right. it's only like quarter after one. So. That's right. That's so true. Yes, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, well thanks again. Yes, thank you. Yay. <laughs> and the crowd went wild. Yeah. Yes. And before we go, do you have anything you want to plug, promote? Um mm -hmm. uh, follow, subscribe to my YouTube. Uh, with a K Games, my TikTok is with a K Erica, and uh, I sometimes remember that I have a TikTok, so you know that one's a little more. Yeah, there you go. I might <laughs> upload something. I don't know. And uh, if you like young adult fantasy adventure books, <laughs> buy my book when it comes out eventually. <laughs> so, <laughs> hooray! Well, that's a plan. Yeah. Hopefully, maybe a year from now. We'll see. Awesome. All right. Thank you. Well, that just about does it. Thank Yay. you, everybody. Yeah, Thanks you. for listening. <laughs> that was a great episode. Thank yeah, you very much, that Erica. That was awesome. Thank you. Really appreciate it. That so was so glad. fun. Yeah. Thanks, neighbor. Oh, my There's an audience here. Hello. <laughs> 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 you know, <laughs> Wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> Man.